Shankaracharya is great devotee of Lord Narasimha. He had composed that Lakshmi Karavalamba Stotra, Lakshmi Narasimha Karavalamba Stotra. So this is one more unique pastime. So when he was proceeding towards Ahobilam, Shankaracharya had vision that he will have darshan of Lord in Ahobilam. So he was proceeding towards Ahobilam when he came to the area of Shri Shailam. That area is called Nallamala Forest. So when he came near that forest area, there are a group of religious sect people who are known as Kapalikas. who believed in human sacrifice. So one day when Shankaracharya was sitting under deep meditation, a Kapalika approached him and he woke up Shankara from his meditation and told him, God Kapali would appear to him if he sacrificed either the head of an emperor or the head of a great sannyas. So Shankara was happy, he was amused. He smiled and said that he had no objection whatever to surrender his head. That he would come to the temple of Bhairava at midnight without the knowledge of his disciples because there are other disciples also along with Shankaracharya. They would not allow him to go to sacrifice himself. So he became overjoyed that his desires will be fulfilled. The Kapalika went back and he started making preparations for his preliminary rites of worship before the human sacrifice. Generally what happens, man proposes, God disposes. So Shankara got up from his bed at the dead of midnight and uh, he left for the temple of uh, Bhairava. So his dear disciple was there whose name is Padmapada. So he sent some danger to his guru and he earnestly played to Lord Narasimha to protect his guru. So he also followed his guru to see what is happening there because he could see some bad omens coming up. So when he came to the respective area, he saw the spot and uh, where the Kapalika had worshipped the deity with all the rituals and uh, he made Shankaracharya sit there and with a big dagger, he was about to chop off the head of Shankaracharya. So at that time, it is said that uh, Lord Narsimha became invoked in the body of Padmapada. dagger from that Kapalika and chopped off the head of that Kapalika itself. And at that particular point, Shankaracharya opened his eyes. He saw Lord Narasimha standing in front of him. So with the vision of Lord Narasimha, he immediately offered prayers which we became Lakshmi Narasimha Karavalamba Stor. Shri Makpayo Nidhi Niketana Chakrapane Bhogendra Bhogamani Rajita Punya Murti Yogesha Shashwata Sharanya Bhavabdi Pota Lakshmi Narsimha Mamadehi Karavalamba So in that way, see how Lord is there for His devotees. So generally we worship Narsimha for this protection perspective. So that whenever devotees feel danger, when they pray to Narsimha, they are assured that Lord is there with them to cross the situation. How He will protect, we don't know. Whether he wants us to go through the situation or he wants us to avoid the situation, whatever it is, it is his mercy. So we should always be praying to Guru and Krishna that we should be engaged in his service so that we get an opportunity of serving great personalities through Guru, the Supreme Lord. And in the process, we become purified and we go back home back to God. Namaste. Sila 
बहिर निसिंह हृदय निसिंह निसिंह महादेव शरण प्रबद्धे Yeah.